YouTube, what to do, baby? We got to talk about some things that just changed in Warzone. We got the patch notes uh, for the update that you guys are going to see um, here in a little bit. Hopefully, once this video is out, or it may have already came out by this video drop. I don't really know. But anyway, man, we're going to cover this stuff really quick, and we're going to see um, what's going on with all these nerfs and all these buffs. Probably some of your favorite weapons might not be your favorite weapons anymore, man. Let's get into it. So we scroll through these. I'm not going to really cover all this stuff right now. If you want to see all this stuff, go to Charlie Intel. They have everything. They are keeping Rebirth Island, Resurgence Quads. Let's go, baby. That's all I play right now. I don't play Verdansk. I play Rebirth Island, and I literally love it so much. Um, we're going to jump all the way to the bottom. If you, like I said, if you guys want to look at all this good stuff, make sure you visit uh, the Charlie Intel page. And you can see all of these patch notes. Guys, there's tons of things. So here we go. The focus of the video. Let me uh, exit out of this little ad really quick. Um, but for the weapons, here's the new weapons right here. We have the MG82 LMG launch week. So basically, uh, once the update drops, we have the new C58 assault rifle. We have the nail gun baseball bat uh, o OTS9 or Otis9. Uh, then we have the mace melee. Um, and right here is what you guys really want to focus on as you guys can see so as you can see the CR 56 a max We have a red down arrow. So nerf um, We can go through the line grows up. We got a double a double buff as what I call it Obviously not the scar got a buff XM4 got a buff AMP 63 which is the uh, new pistols got a buff ballistic knife buff um, street sleeper nerf Thank you so much um, We have a buff sniper but uh, save the same the Swiss K31 the AUG, MW AUG, we have a buff. Bullfrog stayed the same, just they changed the iron sights to make it more visible, so that I guess that would be a little bit of a buff. KSP buff, Milano buff. Um, looks like the Bison got a buff, and the DMR got a buff. So if you guys want to, we'll go through these really quick. I'm not going to cover all the stuff, but we're just going to basically talk about with the buffs and the nerves that we just talked about. So for the assault rifles, the AMAX, guys. So the upper torso damage multiplier decreased from 1.2 to 1.1. 1 .1. um, not a huge difference, but I'm very curious to see if we'll be able to tell and feel the difference when we hop into a match. So here in a little bit, hopefully we'll be able to tell. Um, but not much to that. The Groza got a pretty good buff. As you guys can see, the damage increased from 18 to 23, and that is minimum. Okay, so five, uh, a five increase. So that's very good. So then, as you guys can see, you can go through all of these. Uh, like I said, I'll leave it to you guys to read if you want to go in detail. Assault Rifle Golf right here. We have a um, neck damage multiplier increase from 1 to 1 1.5, which is actually pretty intense. Uh, we have the XM4, uh, 1 to 1 1.5. That thing already melted, and now it just got in and buffed again. So this thing might be meta. Uh, I'm not even going to lie to that. So with the AM63, we have a buff. As you, can, you guys can read all through these. Uh, the melee, we have the Ballistic Knife. Um, that got a buff, so that will be interesting to see how that works in Warzone. Shotgun, Street Sweeper, you guys are going to like this one. Nerf, damage range decreased by 25%, 24% to be exact. Second damage range decreased by 18%. Uh, third damage range decreased by 7%. Move speed decreased by 1%. So, this thing definitely got a nerf, guys. I'm excited. I, was, I got so frustrated uh, dying to that thing. Um, so snipers, I'm not really sure what that, which, what, uh, that sniper is. I don't snipe very often. The Swiss K31, which is a good weapon. Um, it's functionality improved and base reticle updated. Okay, some machine guns. Uh, I'm not sure what that one is either. I really, I don't know. It looks like the AUG, um, got a buff as well. The Bullfrog got an ADS position, uh, buff, iron sights. Um, KSP got a buff. That'll be interesting to see. So the max damage range increased by 16.6%, which is really good. Milano, probably my favorite weapon to use in Cold War multiplayer. Hopefully it's viable in Warzone. That'd be very interesting to see. Um, so you guys can see what it does here. But it looks like the numbers look good. Numbers look good. We'll have to see the, the, um, the right. Uh, I can't talk. Excuse me. The fire rate is what gets this weapon in trouble, in my opinion. So maybe they can buff the fire rate. That would be awesome. Uh, then we'll go down, tactical rifles, the DMR, got a buff. Don't bring us back in that time, baby. We don't want that DMR meta again. Um, then you have these attachments down here, as you guys can see. But that is all we have for today's video, guys. Um, I wanted to keep it really quick for you guys. You guys can go through and read them again if you'd like on my screen, or you can visit Charlie Intel for all the updates about everything new for Season 4. But hopefully you guys enjoy the season, man. Let me know one thing you're most excited about. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Smash that like. Hit the subscribe button down below. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.